everyone. This is Mark with MrHurricaneTracker.webs.com bringing you a tropical update for around the world. This is July 29, 2011 for Northwestern Pacific Ocean. We're taking a look at two tropical storms right now. They're not typhoons yet, but there are two tropical cyclones out there that are watching very close. Now, the tropical cyclone Noctin is going to be the first one we're going to take a look at. Tropical cyclone Noctin is right here by Vietnam and tropical cyclone Noctin. This is warning number 20 from the JTWC at 1500 GMT. Position is at 19.2 degrees north, 109.8 degrees east. Location is about 245 miles east-southeast of Vietnam. Movement is 285 degrees west-northwest at 14 knots, around 15 to 20 miles per hour, give or take. Maximum winds are 40 knots, gusting to about 50 knots. And looks like here the maximum significant wave height is at 21 feet. This is a big storm and it's going to head into Vietnam. Noctin has weakened on passing over Hainan Island but will re-intensify upon re-emerging over the Gulf of Tonkin. Again I'm sorry if I missed pronouncing any of those names. I didn't want to kill it but again that is the information coming in from the JTWC. This is going to be for tomorrow folks. I mean, we're going to keep a very close eye on Vietnam as the storm continues to move in. So a lot of showers and thunderstorms for the storm to move on in and possibly even cause some damage for the, any tornadoes that will come with this uh, tropical cyclone. So again, pretty good sized tropical cyclone headed towards Vietnam. We've got another storm out here called Tropical Cyclone Mufa or Mufa. Again, I'm sorry if I mispronounced that taking a look at the information from the JTWC warning number 17 position of the storm is at 14.1 degrees north 133.9 degrees east again these are tropical cyclones location is 815 miles south southeast of looks like Candina Air Force Base and again I'm sorry if I mispronounce any of these names movement 300 degrees north at 6 knots or around 5 to 10 miles per hour I'll continue to keep you posted on what's happening with it now as far as the information goes that I have now, shows that the maximum winds are 55 knots, gusting to 70 knots. This could very well become a typhoon real shortly, so we'll continue to keep you posted. And again, the threatened landmass doesn't have any threatened landmass right now. It looks like everything's pretty clear as far as any landmass being hit by the storm, as far as the movement goes. Now, tropical cyclone Moifa is moving north across the Pacific and will steadily intensified by the end of the forecast period. The storm will have strengthened to a 95 knot storm system and will begin to veer northwest and at that time I'll continue to bring you updates to let you know exactly what's going to happen with that storm and where it's going to go. So of course we're going to continue to watch both storms including the tropical storm Don. but again this is the actual update for the northwestern Pacific Ocean around the world. So again stay tuned to MrHurricaneTracker.webs.com I'll also post information on the new website that we'll be posting for these updates around the world. Again, thanks for watching. Please, again, rate, subscribe, and comment, and have a wonderful day.